Welcome back to KDKA at 730. A local couple wanted to make a positive impact on the community and run a business at the same time. So they decided, why not do both and run a shaved ice truck here in Pittsburgh. Joining us now live are Bill and Kathy Nelson from Vandergrift. You both launched your Kona ice truck last year. Quite a time to raise money for good causes. So did you ever think it would take off like this? No, we didn't, <laughs> especially during a pandemic. <laughs> right. What kind, what kind of benefits do you give back to the community? What we try to do is go out to each event or organization and raise money, help raise money to keep funding the, whether it's a ball, ball team or, or a fire department. But we give upwards of 20 to 35 percent give back wow. of whatever we take in. What inspired you both to A, decide to get involved in a business, and B, do shaved ice of all things in Pittsburgh? That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> Being that we're seasonal, we wanted to provide shaved ice as many months as we can, mm -hmm. um, help the organizations out, love the students, the adults, kids. It took us. Pardon. It took us uh, probably three years to finally jump into it. I looked at it for at least three years to wow. uh, look and see if it was a good program, a good fit for us. And it was. It truly was. How do you discover new places to go? Driving around a lot. A lot of driving, a lot of around. driving around. <laughs> that and putting our name out on Facebook. Uh, emailing organizations, letting them know who we are, what we can do for them, letting them know fundraising for your your organization or, or fire department is as easy as letting us come out, park the truck, and letting us know who to make the check out to. Wow. So, for example, say a, a fire department called you. How would it work? Well, it would depend on what they would do. Like, we have some local ones around the area that are going to hold food truck rallies. And we'll come out, we'll set up. Through, throughout the day, serve our conas to everybody who wants one, comes out and buys one, and then we turn around and write them a check for the amount that we give back. Wow. Plus, it's cool because you get to see, for instance, like you're doing the pause for a cure, baseball invitational in Freeport. You get to see all the cute little kids and yes, talk to the them. The kids are the best. The kids are the best. So, what all do you have on the calendar? What's next? Uh, Butler Area Soccer Association this weekend starting. The first game is Saturday. Um, Banniger Food Truck Rally. Um, Leechburg Food Truck, truck Rally. For the fire companies. For the fire nice. companies. Well, we you guys will be busy. Yes. You guys will yes. be busy. That's the way to be. It's the only way to be. Yes. That's it. Yes. The busier, the better. Well, thank you both for coming on here tonight to share your, your new endeavor. Best of luck. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you for having us. <laughs>